Oh my goodness. Here I am. This is my room in Florida. This is crazy. I'm... I'm a little bit, uh... A little bit out of it right now. Gotta be honest here. A little bit out of it. Mmm. I'm gonna wait for some more people. How's everyone doing? Good? That's great. Oh, hi, Ethan! What are you doing on my live stream? That's Ethan Whacker. What's up, Ethan? How you doing? <laughs> oh, crap! Oh, it's like two over there! Oh, no! It's two in... in L.A. Oh, no, most people are, like, in school right now. Yikes. You think I should, like, restart this and, like, do it at a later time? Because I'm in Florida, and it's five here. No? Yikes. I, I want to at least wait until, like, some other people are out of school. You think? That would be okay? No? Yes? Well, I know that, I know that you guys aren't in school. Shut up, Sam. Oh, Sam. This is my good friend, Sam. I was literally FaceTiming him like two seconds before I I came on the live stream, so that's fine. You know what? Whatever. I'll just continue the live stream because people can watch it when I post it. That'll be fun. Anyways, hello. I have 483 people watching now. That's good. More than more than half of the people that I get normally so that's good wow so i'm in florida now i'm back in florida i'm sad but i'm also sort of happy in a way i mean i don't know i don't know it's weird because when i came when i came back here when i smelt like my room and when like i don't know like a certain smell like smells usually bring me back more to a place than any other, um, a any other, uh, uh, like, sensory information, like, music or touch or taste. It's weird, but, like, immediately when I came in my room, like, all the memories from last year, like, started flooding back, because all I wanted to do was get out to California, and then when I went out, then I had all new memories, and then that smell, like, was in my brain, and then when I go back to California, it'll bring back memories of... 2017, it's weird. Anyways, so, yeah, I mean, I'm here. It's cool. My bedroom doesn't really look too decorated right now because, um, I took all these down, but I have, uh, it's my Guardians of the Galaxy poster. It's my Man Cave poster. Here's my sword. Here's, uh, my Assassin's Creed poster. Um... Oh, yeah! This was so funny! Okay, so I posted I posted this a while ago. I think I might have deleted it, but... I don't know if you guys watched Spongebob, but, um... In one of the episodes, uh, Squidward makes, like, like he... He paints all these paintings, and, like, he tries to give it to, like, a really fancy, like, art collector or whatever. And he's like, I call this bold and brash. And then he's like, more like, belongs in the trash, and my cousin painted this for me, and I took it off of my wall, because I was, I was repainting it and stuff, but, oh my goodness, this is, it was so funny when she gave it to me. I also have my, of course, classic, uh, you know, the, the, the Star Wars poster. I almost forgot what it was. God, I'm running out of run. Two hours of sleep right now, so, forgive me if I'm a little bit out of it. Anyways. I'm really tired. So here's my room. It's uh, it's quite fun actually. I'll um, I'll show you the wall. There's my um, Battlefront poster thing. My uh, 
I actually got that from GameStop. My sister used to watch it, uh, watch. My sister used to work at GameStop, and uh, she used to get me things like this all the time. Like uh, I used to have like a Alien, like uh, like like the game Alien or whatever. I used to have that, but I threw it away because it got all bent. There's a my Fuller House poster up there. That's cool. It's currently just doing school before I did this. Um, science, nothing crazy. Uh, that's cool. There's my katana. Hmm. It's cool. You get a good look at that. Anyways. Yeah. I haven't showed you this part of my life on a live stream before. But, uh, yeah, I have a whole entire thing. Oh, wait, actually, no. This is, this is the coolest thing in my entire room. Sorry, I'm very distracted. Uh, this right here. This, oh, whoops, let me get my... Sorry, oh, I'm getting my headphones out of the way so you guys can see. Um, this is a piece of fabric from the original Full House couch. And I got it signed by all the original cast. There's Dave, there's Lori, there's Andrea, there's Candace, John Stamos, Bob Saget, I think. And that, there's Jody. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I could sell that for... A lot of money if I ever got broke. <laughs> it's cool. So here's my room. Nothing crazy. Anyways. Oh. I love this thing. It, like, it's magnetic. Little, uh, things. And they, they, like, stick to the... This is, this is a magnet. Link it sticks to the bottom of the thing. I love this thing. I always play with it when I'm just sitting here doing school. We're not sorry, I keep getting distracted. Anyways, I'll take some questions now. I'm feeling I'm feeling like I'm a little uh, little Q and A. Let's hear some. Let's uh see some questions. How's Florida, my dude? Hi Sony. How you doing? Um, Florida's good. Uh, it's, it's weird to be back, for sure. Is Fuller House coming back? Is Fuller House, is Full House coming back? Is Full House coming back? What? What? Never mind, never mind, don't, I'm not gonna look at that one. I'm taking questions. That's what I'm doing right now. Sony, by the way, in case you weren't here before. Why is there no food? You know, I just went to the grocery store less than an hour before this here. Oh, hi, Kayla. How you doing? Are you going to be in Florida around Christmas? I will be in Florida around Christmas, in fact. Yes. Hello from Germany. That's cool. Hannah... Grossi? Gross? Gross? How do you pronounce your last name? Zero four zero. Yo, Lewis. I'm getting a lot of, a lot of friends in this live stream here. I really love these glasses. I actually stole them from Isaac. These are Isaac's glasses, but I, I scammed them from him. He left all of his clothes at my house, and uh, he left these with them as well. So. They're my favorite glasses still. So I'm not gonna get them back. I don't care. He's like, just ship them off to me. I'm like, nah. I'm gonna keep them. In fact, I have like five pictures of me, like, on Instagram, like, with these glasses on in the past, like, uh, like, five days that I've been, that I was in California. Anyways. Will there be a season four of Fuller House? That is a good question. I really. Hope? I, and I believe that there will be. I mean, they've already been talking about season four. Uh, you know, even when we left, they said that they're going to run out the stage for season four again. Um, yeah. It's cool. I really hope so. What do you guys think? What do you guys think should be in season four? I What I want to see? I want to see, like, Jackson interact with, uh, with, like, Steve and Matt more. You know, 
I want to see him have like a father figure, you know, in his life, sort of. I want to have like some bro time, that kind of thing. Also, I want Popco to come back. I want Isaac to be back on the show. But unfortunately, he, he, I mean, he will be back. He, he will be back for as many episodes as he wants to in season four. But Disney was being really gross. And they were like, no, nah, we're not going to let him do that. We're not going to let him uh, be in most of the episodes for season three. So that's why he wasn't in too many. But they will let him be in more in season four if there is one, which hopefully there is one. Today is my birthday. Could you please say hi to me? Of course. Get over here. I'm going to pin your comment. Sony Campion. Um, I'm pretty sure that's... Sony underscore Campion. I would rather not... Marry Sony. That would be a... No. No. I mean... Unless it's like Sony and... Like, Campion? I mean... No, not about that. I know so many people who want, like, Ramona and Jackson to, like, be a thing, but... I don't know. That's weird. That's weird. That's weird. It's like liking your sister. No. Get out of here, Lewis. Ha ha ha, I ship it. Yeah, get out of here. I don't know. She already knows my thoughts on it, but people are like, Oh, that's so cute. Like, you should totally be with Sony. Like, I'm good. <sighs> What's your favorite Star Wars movie? You know, that is a good question. I know a lot of people... Really like, um, oh wait, hold on, let me, let me, let me pin your comment. Uh, I know a lot of people really liked, um, Force Awakens and stuff. It wasn't really about the Force Awakens, I was more about Rogue One. I really like Rogue One a lot. I just, uh, I don't know, I'm about those, like, underdog movies, you know, I, I don't really like, um, like, where everything is OP, like, they have the Force, they... Have all this stuff. I like to see just like normal people doing this stuff. You know, I think that's really cool. But if I had to pick something besides Rogue One, it would probably have to be. Mm -hmm. That's really hard. Return of the Jedi. That I'd say that. I'm sticking my answer. Return of the Jedi. Sorry, I'm reading the comments. I can barely read it from, like, this far, so I gotta get, like, really close. It's like, that's a good screenshot. You know, like, my face, like, super close to the camera, and, like... Don't, please don't screenshot that. <sighs> oh, jeez. Sam. Um, Fuller House... Is actually the sequel to Full House, Sam. And, um... <laughs> God, please never search up my IMDb. Because, uh... You'll find some things in there that are really cringy. Such as, um... Robodog. And Robodog Airborne. If you can see that right here. Oh, no. Robodog, I was just a little kid. I was like... 11? 10? It seems like not that long ago, and like... It didn't seem that long ago, but... I don't know, I've changed so much. Like, so much. And um, also, if you look up my IMDb, uh, a little show I did with Lewis, actually. Lewis was on the show. Um, Three Musketeers. That was uh, young Three Musketeers, actually. It was about... Um, It was about, obviously, the three young musketeers. But then there was also, like, a spin-off series called Young Robin Hood, where I played a part in it. And I was, like... D'Artagnan? I think that was his name? And Lewis was Porthos? And we were, like, little kids. 
Oscar-worthy performance, let me tell you. It was... Yikes. Uh, if you ever want to look up clips of it, go ahead, look up Three Musketeers. Young Three Musketeers or Young Robin Hood. D'Artagnan or whatever. And oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> Most of the acting is really bad. Like, so bad. Not not from, like, me or Lewis, but, like, from some of the other people. Like, they're really yikes. I mean, hey, gotta be honest here, my performance was pretty bad, too, if we're being honest here. Um, yeah. If you want to have, like, cringy screenshots, go ahead and do that. I'd like to see them. Actually, I want to start a thing. Whoever can find the cringiest screenshots of me, put them into, like, a collage, or put them into, like, like a, a series of pictures, and you tag me in them, you post it on your thing, and you tag me. I will screenshot my favorite three, and I will post them. Like, uh, stuff from Christmas Trade, Robodog, Robodog Airborne, um, Three Musketeers, yeah, there's a lot of good, a lot of good cringy content in there, you got, y'all can screenshot. <laughs> I actually have Robodog and Robodog Airborne on DVD at my house currently. Oh my god, I have so many people asking me if I'm Team Matt or Team Steve. Alright, y'all, I'm seeing the subject here. Team Matt... Or Team Steve. I've already answered this. But I'm gonna do it again. Anyways. Uh, I personally like Matt as like a father. Better. But um. I don't know. Like Steve is just. Steve is like her love. You know. Like they were a thing. Y'all just gotta see in season. 3B. Like the, the second part of season three. Y'all just gotta see what happens. It's... Man, that screwed me up. Even watching the episodes. Like, I watched some of, um... I watched some of the episodes for season three, the second part? Boy, I was like... Ugh, it was making me, like... Ah, uh, what is the word? Like... Uh, at the edge of my seat. That's That's what it is. At the edge of my seat. You guys will like it for sure. You know, of course I'm gonna pin your comment. Get over here. I like this guy. Just John Owen? Yeah. You had a bad day? You know what? That's okay. I pinned your comment. There you go. Oh god. Dom just texted me. He's in. Yes, Dom. I'm not gonna reset my live stream, Dom. I'm not gonna do that. Sorry. Someone else is texting me. Don't worry about it. Um. Oh man. Oh, did you guys? Okay, did you guys happen to see my uh, the the the, the videos that I posted of me and Lewis doing Copacabana? That was. That was comedy gold right there. That was really good. You guys should see the unedited version. Um, I edited a lot of it. I took out a lot of the stuff because it was like seven minutes long. Something like that. But, uh, boy. <laughs> <sighs> oh, jeez. Her name was Lola. She was a showgirl. <laughs> That's funny. With yellow feathers in her hair, and I just got down there, and she whipped my ring and do the cha cha. Oh, yeah, that was, speaking of that, that was funny when I shot that for season three. That was hilarious. If you guys ever saw um, that episode when I was doing Copacabana for Lola or whatever, because. That was really fun to shoot. Really fun. Oh, man. I have to show you guys something. Next live. Next live stream. 
So, we actually just got the the blooper reel of um all of the uh, you know the the bloopers from season three, and uh, I'm not allowed to like post it. I'm not allowed to, like post on, on any social media, but um I want you guys to see my part specifically, like all the bloopers that I say, because uh, literally anytime that I mess up, I say the exact same thing. I say um oh shoot oh crap. Oh, no, it's okay. All right, mate, let me do that again. I say, like, those are the only things that I cycle through when I mess up. Um, God, my mannerisms are just so, like, like you can just pinpoint my mannerisms. Like, actually, Lewis, right here, the one who is, uh, who's pinned, you, you should know him from my, uh, from my posts and stuff. He's my best friend, by the way, in case you guys didn't know. Um, what was I saying? Crap, I just forgot what I was saying. <laughs> um, Lewis, I was talking about Lewis. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He can do a great impression of me. He can do the best impression of me. Oh my god, you guys don't even understand. Like, <laughs> I, 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 anytime that I talk, I'm very, I use my hands a lot. But, like, I, I do the same thing with my hands. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Very cool, you know? Like, like, 100% for sure. If you guys have ever met me in person. Um... Lewis, honestly, you need to do a video for me, and, and, and I'll post it. I'll post, like, here. Actually, you know what? You know what I'm going to do? I have an idea. So, Lewis, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to post a video of me doing my mannerisms. Like, hey, but yeah, 100%, totally. I'm going to send it to you. You try to, you, you copy that, right? You, you do the same thing, and then I put the videos side by side just to see how accurate this kid actually is. It's crazy, because... Um, you know, another person who can do it really well is Sony, because, you know, if you guys see, uh, yeah, yeah, Sony and I, yeah, Sony can do it really well as well, so. Anyways, what time is it here? Hold on, let me check the time real quick. It's currently 2.23. I actually have my computer in front of me, so I don't have to click out of the live to, uh, look at the time anymore, which is good. Um, 2.23. I'm actually gonna go at... 225, or not 225, whatever time it is, at the 25th minute of the whatever hour you're in, um, because I have to do a lot of stuff today. I have to do school, which I still haven't done, unfortunately, and, uh, I have to actually learn lines. I have to learn more lines, which is not fun either. Mm. What else do I have to do? I have to put up all of those posters back on my wall. Because I had to repaint it. And, um... Just gonna... Fool around. I don't know. What else can I do? It's weird, because it's like 5 o'clock here. And I'm running out of time really quickly. I, I woke up at 1 today. Which is like 10 my time. 10 California time, or whatever. So... What do you what do you have to learn lines for? I have to learn lines for a movie. It's not it's not a movie. It's like all right. So it's a short film that I'm doing. Uh, I'm actually leaving in two days to go to Georgia. I forgot to tell you guys that I'm leaving in two days to go to Georgia, uh, and this short film is um, actually one of my really good friends. Uh, he. He's, like, a director and, like, a screenplay writer, and he's, like, 20-something. But he used to be really good friends with my sister. He actually used to date her. And, uh, we're just doing him a favor. We're doing it now. It's really cool. And I think you guys should definitely check it out. Uh, it's called Bite, I'm pretty sure. And you can look it up on, um, you can look it up on Facebook. It's, like, Bite Movie Official or whatever. It's a short film. And, uh, essentially what it is, it's, like, this guy... Like, this little kid, me, uh, he's, like, in this apocalypse, and everybody died around him, and he gets, like, an infection. Yeah, it's not a very fun movie, but, uh, it's good, because I have to cry in it, so. And I have, like, five lines, so. Hopefully learning it will be easy, but I have to still look at the stage directions and stuff, so that's fine. Okay, guys. Well, it is 2.25, or whatever 25th minute it is in your hour, so I'm gonna head out, but, uh... <laughs>
Oh, Lewis. Hold on, I'm I'm posting. I'm pinning this one. Sorry. Um, <laughs> it's an inside joke we have. Uh, my sorry, sorry. I'm still talking. Um, I just have to tell you the story. Uh, my my uh, my Krav instructor, my Krav my God instructor. Uh, his name is Master Solomon, and he always calls me like like Michael Campione. Like it's really weird. I don't know why he does it, but um, that those are all, like all the videos that I post um, about. Uh, like 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 me fighting or whatever, um, and Lewis took the class with me a few times, and we always make fun of his mannerisms and like the way that he talks because he has a really thick Israeli accent, and uh, it, he's just so funny. He's hilarious. But anyways, sorry. That's I had to explain to you why I pinned his comment. Okay, guys, I'm gonna head out. I'll see you later. Bye.